Ravi, those calls come as Chicago police are still trying to talk with Jesse Smollett regarding the latest evidence gathered in their investigation. Detectives getting that evidence from two people who have ties to the actor. Chicago police following new leads in the Jesse Smollett investigation. A CPD spokesperson tweeting this afternoon, while we're not in a position to confirm, deny, or comment on the validity of what's been unofficially released, there are some developments in this investigation and detectives have some follow-ups to complete, which includes speaking to the individual who reported the incident. The investigation began nearly three weeks ago when the Empire actor claimed he was attacked in the Streeterville neighborhood by two men shouting racial and homophobic slurs. The men who are brothers are no longer in police custody after hours of questioning. Sources confirm reports that the brothers who had a pre-existing relationship with Smollett were paid by him to carry out the attack and that detectives may have in their possession a receipt for the rope found around Smollett's neck. Today, a civil rights activist based in Los Angeles called for Smollett to be prosecuted. We have many members of the black community and the LGBT community who have been the victims of racism and hate crimes. So for Smollett to say that he was a victim of racism and hate crime, and we believe that it's a lie, certainly is an injustice to those true victims of racism and hate crimes. Mm. In a statement late last night, attorneys for Smollett responded to those allegations that the attack was staged, saying nothing is further from the truth and anyone claiming otherwise is lying. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.